are just one day away from the royal wedding. Welcome to a special royal edition of Access Hollywood from a dressed up and ready to go London, England. A flurry of activity all over town. Last minute rehearsals, a little football for the prince, and of course, we have the official wedding program. But it was only one half of the couple, a beaming Kate, taking part in a rehearsal at Westminster Abbey today. Holding out her hands, Kate seems to be checking her nerves by the bride's side instead of William, Prince Harry. Here he is arriving to the church under a tent covering the entrance. Also taking part, Mom Carol and Sister Pippa. Kate's and William's friends will be on the far left next to her family. These will include Elton John, who performed at Princess Diana's funeral, and the Beckhams. William and David worked together recently as ambassadors of England's 2008... The lost royal family photos of Princess Di, Prince Charles, and Prince William unearthed. Welcome to a special royal wedding edition of Access Hollywood. Tim Vincent is at Kensington Palace. Richard and Diana decided to style her hair in an updo. It was in 1984. The first time she wore her hair up, you know, it was front page news. Since November 16th, when their engagement was announced, details of the wedding have been slowly leaking out. Not anymore. Right now, let's take you inside. While a beaming Kate was escorted down the aisle by her father, William remained facing forward, the very last one to see his beautiful bride. As for Harry, <laughs> he couldn't wait. Wow! Kate said it herself on Buckingham's balcony, and it's exactly what the whole world was thinking. And how's that for a victory lap? Welcome to our spectacular royal wedding edition of Access Hollywood. At 1.27 p.m. London time, William whispers to his bride, then kiss number one, short but sweet. 500,000 royal watchers who had flocked to the gates of Buckingham Palace for a glimpse of the newlyweds erupted in delight, as did the thousands gathered at Trafalgar Square, where Tim Vincent was right in the middle of the...